Merry Christmas Eve, everybody. I am sitting here with the baby and Elijah, and he is playing with the baby. So if you hear something, that is them. Uh, we had a, our annual Christmas Eve, um, like kind of like a Friendsgiving family get together for Christmas Eve um, party, and it is a disaster in here. Um, so I'm going to put a sweater on. It's kind of chilly right now. I'll probably end up changing again later on. But we got to get this place cleaned up because Santa has got to come and he will not come in a messy house so let's get this place cleaned up and let's just hop into it if you're new here I'm Lorelai and I'm a mama of four newly engaged you see that yes I'm gonna say it on every video um, but I live in California and I am from Florida so hopefully we can make our way back to that side of the states pretty soon but if you're new here on my channel I believe that you're not perfect I'm not perfect and nobody is perfect and that is perfectly okay like subscribe share this video I'm a real person I do not come on here and fake the funk and I'm not gonna do it for you or anybody else so let's get on to this <laughs> all right how is everybody doing as you can see we have a disaster so kind of what happened was i kind of just put i like to make kind of like a charcuterie board type counter um i didn't do too much recording of the stuff that i made actually i don't even think i did any of the stuff that i made but i did record all of this um this was the aftermath we actually had so many people here um that was the leftover mexican hot chocolate and i will make a video of that because the kids do want some more but as you can see everything was just torn up from top to bottom in my kitchen um the living room wasn't too bad it was just some card games and whatnot so i went ahead threw on a sweater and just started cleaning up um How's everybody's holidays going so far? I hope everybody is doing wonderful. The baby's in the background right now and she's playing with this little toy. Have you guys seen those little toy dogs that like walk and uh, you press the back of them and they kind of like walk around the mall? You know, those little shops that are in the middle of the mall. <laughs> well, she's like flipping it upside down. Don't throw it. <laughs> Um, but so what I'm kind of trying to do here is I want to first start and get all the garbage excuse me, cleaned up. I just had a soda. Whew. Um, and put all the dishes in one spot. So that way, once that is done, then we can begin to remove everything else. But does anybody else do Christmas parties during the holiday season? I know family gets together, but do you guys ever have like a Christmas party or do you guys just do just family or how does that work with you guys? Um, let me know in the comments below. I love talking back to people and I love interacting. And like I always tell you guys, I am a real person and I'm not those people that sugarcoat stuff. I'm not going to fake it. I'm going to be real and show you like you know my house is not perfect and we we argue and we fight and we get along and we have fun and we don't have fun <laughs> but this day was absolutely fun um we had people from my honey's work come over oh my goodness that's amazing she's showing me the dog uh take it to buck go take it to eli um <laughs> so noisy in my house right now but i wanted to get this video out oh he was telling me he's like babe i have something in my eye can you please blow in my eye it's really hurting me he has really long eyelashes but the way his eyelashes are kind of go downwards and like in towards the crease of his eye so he kept on getting poked in the eye by it and he was just asking me to blow out his eyes so that way he could kind of feel a little bit better. Um, so I ended up, I got the whole counter cleaned off. Those little baskets have like silverware in them, um, some plates and, you know, uh, everything else. I did make some Grinch punch for the kids and then I made some Grinch adult punch which is absolutely delicious it tasted like just regular almost like a, a hawaiian fruit punch it was really really good um but we kind of just we can uh we kind of just we can we kind of just um you know did some adult fruit punch and then i we had some caesar salad and 
Um, <laughs> she wants me to press the dog. There you go. Um, so what did we do? I made pot roast. I made, um, gr it was all Grinch themed. So I made Grinch um, pot roast since they have pot roast on in the Grinch movie. And then I made the Grinch green beans and bacon. I made, um, what else did I make? I made the garlic knots. Um, we had Caesar salad. I made homemade popcorn Grinch balls. Um, what else? We had homemade Mexican hot chocolate, which we call Abuelita. Um, we had cupcakes and cheesecake a friend of ours made um, that was absolutely delicious. What else? We had so much um, stuff to put on top of the hot chocolate and candy. And it was just a really, really good time. Um, now I'm just going to get all the dishes done first. I'm going to try and get them all put away because there was dishes in the dishwasher that were clean and Elijah didn't do them that night, which that was his chore, but I just told him just go to bed and I'll do it. So as you can see, I'm just putting all the groceries, uh, the groceries, <laughs> the dishes away here. Um, so that way I can reload it. I kind of am the type of person that likes to do stuff and clean when there's nobody around me. I guess I'm just used to it. Um, so I'm just going to get these all put away. So do you see on my kitchen countertop to the, gosh, if you're, it's the big circular glass dish. It had all my Caesar salad in it. I am so in love with that bowl. I found it at the Goodwill and I absolutely love it. Um, you can do like layers of food inside of it. We, like I said, just did the Caesar salad and served the Caesar salad out of it, but I'm absolutely in love with it. I have that one. And then I believe they're, are they called like chifles, chifles? I don't know what they're called. Um, I'm not that sophisticated guys, <laughs> but, um, I'm going to try and load up this dishwasher as best as I can. So instead of getting regular circular plates we had so many goodies that i found these um divided plates at the dollar store and i figured that would be better so people can put their food in um and it's not all touching and smushing together and i i don't know i'm weird about that and i like my food to be separated so yeah but i mean so i got those and <laughs> um we had you know a lot of extras so we just saved those um the thing that it's on was the adult punch which was a very good mixture like i was saying earlier it is the green hawaiian punch and it was pine 100 percent pineapple juice we got the dole kind in the can and then it was the pineapple um what is it malibu pineapple rum and we put some Sprite inside of there also. It was delicious. And I threw some frozen cranberries in there as well. Kind of like ice to keep your drink cold. Um, very, very delicious. And that was just what was left over. So, of course, I'm not going to keep it. But I just had it. Yeah, I was so, so tired. I was like, okay, this has to be done. And, you know, it just, it needed to be done. So I'm starting, I'm trying to, like I said, get everything off of the counters. And I'm trying to be more, I guess you can say, I'm trying to be better at doing this um, each night because after having a baby i found out what the leading doctors i guess say is they say you know it can take up to two years to get back into your routine and i pretty much have my routine back but i'm kind of just like getting back into the groove of things after you know not having a little baby for 11 years and then whoop, here you go um, i'm kind of just getting back into the groove of things um so i'm trying to be better about that again and i wanted to wash the big pots and pans and lids and glass bowls um 
just to make more room in the sink and just knock those out right away. So I went ahead and I just tried to do all the big ones and try and get those done. Make sure if you guys have these like juice containers, guys, those little pieces where the sprout, the spout is, they come out so you can scrub them. And I don't think a lot of people know that, but they do get mold in there if you leave the stuff in there. So go ahead and clean that out. Um, I'm, you know, I'm sitting here chatting your guys' ears off and I would love to know what are some of your favorite, favorite dishes? This is one of my family's favorite dishes and it's called Abuelita. And what it is, is it's a Mexican hot chocolate and there is many, many ways that people make it. My way of making it, of course, is with the abuelita bars of chocolate. And then I add, I shred that up and like I chop that up really finely and then we add some cinnamon sticks in there. We add sugar, of course, in there. And then I add Aztec um, bars of chocolate in there. So that's one. And we like to drink that every year. My kids beg me for it. They're like, Mom, are you going to make the abuelita? <laughs> um, so I'll make that some more during this season. And I'll show you guys how I make mine. Um <laughs> She's playing with her little mermaid baby that she got for Christmas. Um, and she's like saying, yay, she's happy. Are you happy? Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> Um, if you guys didn't know, now you know you can lift up your stove. I guess a lot of people didn't know about this, but you do want to lift it up and clean up from underneath your stove. Uh, there's a lot of women out there, men included, that were not taught how to clean properly. And I just want to be of some assistance and let you know. Lift it up, clean up from underneath there, get all the nasties out of there. I do clean with bleach, guys. Strictly just bleach. I get a spray bottle, fill it up with bleach and a little bit of hot water, and I'm good to go. Um, clean off over here by the microwave. And as you can see, there was still so much stuff. I do like to keep this on my stove, so I do like to wipe that down. And my flour and my rice, I use those on a daily basis. Hello, Lorelai. She keeps, I keep looking up. I'm like, she's keep looking up. I'm talking the what, what do they call it? The third party? <laughs> um, I found this sweater off of Thread Up and it's super, super comfy. It's so, it's one of those super oversized baggy sweaters. So it makes you look like you're 10 sizes bigger than you are, but it's so comfy. I absolutely love it. And then I had just taken, um, my hair down and then just threw it back up in a clip so it looks all funky but it is what it is so i you know we did we went i went to costco for this party i went to walmart for this party to get all the food and everywhere else and i was just super super tired and i think the time that i went to bed after cleaning up was about three o'clock um Oh, okay, so I did end up going and doing an outfit change because I got hot. Um, I like to keep some coffee on my counter uh, right next to the coffee pot, and then I like to keep, as you've seen, the hot chocolate so the kids can make some hot chocolate. But as you see, my counter is disgusting. What this is, is it's, the, it's just the pot roast from when people were serving themselves and dripped and whatnot, so getting this all cleaned up and like I said I was super super hot but again I hope you guys are liking my channel so far I you know I can sit here and talk and talk and talk for days but I'm really enjoying making these videos for you guys and I would love to know would you guys like more cleaning cooking videos more real videos like like realist I guess you can say videos what would you guys like to see uh, let me know in the comments below I am a very friendly person I'm a real person and and I love to communicate with you guys. So I'm just going to finish up what I can here in the kitchen. And then we are going to close this video out. And 
all those are all of our Christmas cups but thank you guys so much for stopping by and I really hope that you guys subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed yet um I didn't get a chance to show you guys the after but I'm really grateful for you guys and like and share this video and there's going to be another one posted below for Christmas time that you guys can come and check out see you in the next one